Hello, everybody. <coughs> I hope. Oh my god, I'm losing my voice. Is this going live? I haven't had a notification to say so. Have I sorted out the keys? I'm not sure. Ha! You got there first. <laughs> Hello everybody, hello, hello, hello. I'm sure Swedish House won't be too far away. And I don't think Lee Robertson will be too far away as well either. Oh, you would be, oh, and Gumdio as well. Hello everybody, how is everybody? Look at this, that's the quickest response ever. How is everybody? <laughs> awesome, really appreciate it guys. Really appreciate it. As you can see by the screen, I'm playing uh, go ghosts, and, sorry, ghosts and Goblins. It was requested uh, by quite a few people actually. Um, and I've had a bit of practice over the last week or so. So now it's time to see if it's all paid off. I haven't completed it yet. But uh, hold on a second, let's try and get this sorted. It is working, I promise you. There we go. How is everybody? <laughs> oh wow, wow, look at this response. I'm actually really excited. I've, I've been looking forward to today. I don't know why, but I really have. Um, hello Jamie and Anthony, and me, and Gumjo and Lee. Wow, many people here today. Ant, I wanted to be first. Hello everybody. Yeah, I was actually really excited about today. The reason for that was, even though I did enjoy the PlayStation 1 stream, it just didn't have the same response it just wasn't as as popular so I was quite excited to get back onto the Amiga and I'm, I'm, I'm in the Amiga mood so yeah absolutely Amiga for life no question absolutely no question uh, I mean, I've got lots and lots of games gaming systems but nothing comes close to the Amiga it, it really doesn't um, I'm watching the life. I'm watching the life below zero. Oh, you're, you're multi-watching, are you? <clears throat> I have no idea what that is. Absolutely no idea. <clears throat> I don't know. Happy, happy with the. But yes, everything's. How does it? How does it sound? Does it sound all right? Is there any blipping? Any uh, any interference or anything like that? Let's get the gobbledygook gook out of the way first. But yeah, I think this has probably been the best of, of all the s streams I've done. I think this has been the best response in the first two minutes ever. So I really appreciate that, guys. I've had a bit of a tweak. I've adjusted a few more things, and hopefully it looks it looks okay. Looks okay. But we have Lee Robertson back. Woohoo! Welcome back, Lee. Uh, poor Lee. He has, because uh, obviously he works nights, so he doesn't... He's not able to tune in every single week, which is a shame, but yeah, we've got to, we've got to work to pay the bills. But uh, welcome back. It's, we've missed you. We've all missed you. It's nice to have you back. And the cat video cracked me up. Oh, is that the one where he's playing the... That was brilliant. I love that. That was really good. Right. Okay, now I've been having a little bit of practice of this game over the last few weeks, um, and it's paying off, hopefully. Uh, I still haven't completed it, but uh, Swedish House, I'm trying, my friend, I really am trying, but hopefully I'll, I'll get there. What makes this really, really difficult? Yes, excellent, excellent. Um, what makes this game really difficult to complete uh, is the fact there's no continues. Hello, Andreas. There's no continues. Now, on other versions, the SNES or NES, you do get continues. In fact, you get unlimited continues. Um, but the Amiga version, you don't. You get six lives, which I think is probably more. Ah, hello. Um, not a problem. Nice to see you. Well, well so, sort of see you. Thanks for tuning in. Really appreciate it. Excellent. Um, Yes, I, I recognised your name. Yes, I must come up and see you one day. Cause it's been so long since, since I last saw you. Yes, me and Joe, we used to go to school together. So, great to have you on board. But yes, all right, ten minutes. I better crack on. But here we go. Let's see if my practice has paid off. So, obviously, this is 
a very difficult game. It was voted, a, you know, one of the most difficult games of all time. Um, whether this is the most difficult version, I'm not sure. I haven't played the NES version, but that does look ridiculously hard. But I suppose if you've got unlimited credits, that does help. But this one, you don't. But you do have six lives. Ha! <laughs> Even though this is your first time on my stream, you know my saying. Hello, everybody. Hmm. Obviously, this game is timed. Now, I actually learned a few things yesterday because I had a little practice last night. And I didn't realise that when you get to a checkpoint, obviously it saves your position, but you also your time increases. So that is good. Now, these gargoyles, without a shadow of a doubt, are the most difficult bit by a long shot. I have tried so many times, I cannot figure out what is the best tactic for these guys. Because they follow you, there's just no there's no pattern. Ah my word. Right. Now unfortunately I don't have a box for this game. I wish I did. I was having a look on you um I was on I was having a look on eBay yesterday and yeah it's quite it's going for quite a lot of money. But how is everybody? How's your weeks been? Oh yes, I've got about that. Yes, I do have it on the C64. I've got it on floppy disk. But unfortunately my floppy disk drive doesn't work. I need to get that fixed somehow. Hold on. Do not get that weapon. That is the worst weapon by a long shot. Oh, Well, so far so good. So far so good. That's the first level. <sighs> okay. Now I don't know if you can actually pause this game. I'm hoping so. I don't know if you can... Oh, no. Alright, so this is the second level. Now this is going to be a bit difficult to watch the chat on this guys because I don't think you can actually pause this. I mean, right, when I first played it, because I hadn't played it before, I wasn't too sure to be in with, but it is definitely growing on me. Right, hold on. So many very, very difficult enemies, but I'm starting to figure out the pattern. I would very much like to finish it. Whether it be today, I, I doubt it, but I will finish it. Okay. I've also got. Go uh, Ghouls, uh, sorry, ghouls, ghouls and ghosts. I've got that as well. That one I have finished, but that was a very, very long time. Right. Is that for these birds? Birds of a pain. So thanks for tuning in everybody! It's excellent. This game is a little bit glitchy. Uh, when, when you're sort of 
falling from big heights or jumping a long way, it does tend to go a bit glitchy. It's, it's nothing to do with the stream, it's just the way it is. Stay single. <laughs> Beast 2, I know! <laughs> I know! I know. Well, hopefully it doesn't take... Hopefully it doesn't take me 29 years. But, you know, this game, it, well, I, was a re I was really terrible at it when I first played it, but I'm definitely getting better. So hopefully Beast 2 will be the same. Right, this one you actually get two bosses. There we go. Boom! Right, quickly catch up. Um, I was... Oh, my word. Been gardening, put fence screening up, and okay. Uh, Mega version is more difficult than NES, is it? Okay. Uh, complicated idea, fence law. Rather than you, what's next on your list for long play, Jamie? Birds are a pain. Stay single. Beast two still waiting. Stay. Uh, can't live with. Can't live without. Uh, well, good start. Boom. <laughs> oh, click the key. Forgot about that. Obviously, you get your armor back. Uh, there's not a lot of opportunities to get your armor back. Yay! Thank you! I cannot tell you how... Well, it was confusing because you and Ansley had exactly the same picture. But yeah, you listened to my you listened to my comment. I said, uh, have a picture of a horse. It makes sense to have a picture of a horse. But I was getting into such a tangles. I didn't know who was, who was talking to me. When I'm watching the game, I couldn't tell whether it was you or Anthony. Now I know. Yeah, Jamie. How are <laughs> how is Andreas? How is uh, Lee? How is Gumdio? Oh no, hang on. See, took them, took my eyes off the screen there. Now you do gain extra life through score, so I'm actually got seven lives now. Now you, you can pick up a lot of these collectibles. There's one of an ar a red armor and there's one of a red shield, but they don't do anything. It's just points. To get your armor back, it's extremely rare. But these gargoyles, they are an absolute pain. And I've watched a few YouTube videos this week just to see what the tactic is with them. And they're all the same, there's no real set pattern, it's just luck, really, because they, they chase you. It takes three hits to kill them, but there's no set pattern to them. <sighs> Time ticking, hi horse, yeah Jamie, oh, uh, it's a horse. Hi, hi speed shouter, new predator trader out, yes, I saw it yesterday, all good sitting on my l Oh, hold on. Yes, Lee was very disappointed. He was uh, looking forward to that all week, wasn't he? It was a bit like a, a child waking up on Christmas morning and he didn't get what he asked for. He was a bit disappointed. He, he was very disappointed. He was like, <laughs> looking forward to it all week and it didn't work. Mind you, I've been having a few problems with my C64. I don't know what the issue is. Right, now I've got two of them! <laughs> they are just evil. There's just no... I can't figure out their pattern. I don't think there isn't, there isn't one. Yes, it did look a bit complicated, however, I've never played that game, so I can't really sort of say. Obviously, I love the film. The film is, is, is brilliant, obviously. Who doesn't like the Goonies? Ah, oh, I've got him, but he got me. Okay. Ah. The best level... Well, so far... 
Out of all my attempts, the best level I've got to so far is level... Level 5. It's the best I've done. No, I've never played Goonies, if that's what you're... If, you're, if that's question... If that's to me? No, not played it. But I love the film. The film's brilliant. I mean, these enemies, they just, they just appear everywhere. Sometimes even in the, in the ground. There's no real pattern to them. Uh, still one more of those gargles around here somewhere. Oh, you're talking about you're talking about uh, predators. Uh, yeah, predator. Yes, the original is, is awesome. The best way to kill the red devils is to hit them before they start flying around. Yeah, when they're asleep. But that that, first, that one there, he's not asleep. He's in the air pretty much from the from the from the go. You got to hit him three times. And this is the best weapon. And you can't outrun them either. They just follow you. Alright. Okay. Now over here, which I figured out yesterday as well, there is actually another armour. Go up this ladder and it drops. Well, it did yesterday. <laughs> yes. There we go. So I learnt that yesterday. This level has so many of these gargoyles, there's like four of them on this level, I think. Ugh. Ugh. Ah! <laughs> Second bit. Oh, hang on a minute. No, I didn't like the crucifix. No, I didn't like it because there's just no hardly any range to it. The range is rubbish. This is really difficult to read all the chat, guys. I'm really struggling at the moment. Missed so many already. Oh my goodness, my See if they stay on the ground like that, they were they are an absolute doddle. But they hardly ever do that. Right, so collect the armor. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha! 
Ah, no! No! Oh, no! Uh, love, love my Amiga, Ant. Play it whenever I have spare time. Go take his grapes. Kushti! Good deal, that wasn't it. Yes, mate, you stole it from him. What is pause on this game? <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have a box. So I don't actually know. Come on, Jamie. Let's do this. Ah! Right. There's still one more gargoyle, and then we have a boss, which is a dragon. See, it's a bit stuttery, but that's the way it is, I'm afraid. quite frustrating because I got to level uh, 5 last night. Right, I've got to catch up on this chat. Really, really have. Okay. I'll have another go in a sec, people. I am so behind. Look at these comments. Right. Uh, not watched the trailer. Yes, I saw the trailer yesterday. It's not bad. Not bad. Uh, love the original with Ali. Predator 2 with Danny Glover. Best Predator you Devil Devils, yes. 2 3 he sounds. Uh, you're a gaming legend. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, and you're you're a really nice guy as well. And I'm sure you're a legend. You're yeah, you're a legend as well. You are a legend. Everyone's a legend. We're all legends. We're all legends. Um, yeah, that's not a good thing. Naked by a gargoyle. Gar naked by a go gargoyle. Yeah, that's not something you say every day, is it? I can't say it either. Uh, how's the Amiga Lee? Best second weapon crucifix. Um, Kushti. You start from him. They looks hard to kill. They are. Uh, I bought a BBCP, fixed a few bits that Get It UK bought for me already. Where's Lambrini, Jamie? Love an eBay deal. Jamie, you need uh, you need assistance to read the chat, I know. And now I'm going to eat ya. Uh, having a vid chat with a bird later, so I will shoot in a mojo, hojo. Behave yourself, Ant. How times, how times have changed, Ant. Where's Lambrini? <coughs> Here. There's not a lot in there. But I'm being good at the moment. I'm 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 sticking with orange juice for the moment. All right. I'm gonna have another go because I can get further than that. But let's just try and catch up now. Yay! Right. Right. Um. Today, obviously, I'm gonna do. Obviously, I'm playing this, which was requested last week and a week before that as as well. No, 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 no vodka. I'm also gonna play UG, which I've never. I think I've only played a demo of. I don't know a lot about it. I'll play UG, probably not for very long. Then I'm gonna play Venus the Fly Trap, uh, and then I, I, I've also had a request uh, about. 20 minutes before the stream started, someone asked for cannon fodder. So I might play a bit of cannon fodder, and then any requests be cool. Ah! Spacebar is pause. There we go, guys. I'll be able to do it now. We now know the secret. Spacebar. Boom! That works. That works. No, you can't see my bum. Why would you want to see my bum for, Anthony? Ah. Uh, yes, I, I don't know how long it'll be, but to be honest with you, I do love a challenge. And, uh, obviously I've got my mouse. My, I, 
I, I like this mouse because it's not as uh, sensitive as the one that you was using around Antony's. But yes. That was a poor display. Hang on a minute. Um, yes, I have... Yes, there's my ghouls and ghosts. I don't have uh, ghosts and goblins as a box. I've also got, on the PSP, I've got ultimate ghosts and goblins, which is very, 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 very difficult, but never finished it. But if you haven't played it, you must check it out. It's awesome. Um, but yeah, that's the only ones I've got. I don't have any others, which is quite surprising. Well, you got further than me. Well, yeah, I got to level 5 last night, but uh, yeah. It's those gargoyles. If, if, there were, if there was no gargoyles, I think I probably could finish it. But they're, they're so difficult to figure out. It's just luck, really. A lower, lower luck. I mean, this level... Oh, hang on, I've got a long comment here. Sorry, i got to go. Really enjoy the live streams, mate. Would love to see you play Magic Land Dizzy on the C64 at some point. One of my old favourites. All the best. Okay, I will make a note of that. I'll buy it, and I'll do it just for you. But yeah, really appreciate it. Have a nice weekend. Really appreciate it. Take it easy. Honestly, the, the, the viewers are the most important. I mean, I've got some really, really awesome viewers. Even if you're just tuning in for five, ten minutes, really appreciate it, guys. Rip Dangerous 2. Yes, I've... Yeah, I am... Um, whoa! Hold on. Yeah, I've played both of them, but the, both of them are very, very difficult. Yeah, they're brutal. Absolutely brutal. Oops. That was close, Jamie. But you know, you can run, you can run off the screen, and they follow you. So there's no getting rid of them. And apparently, I read in, I was reading on on um, online last night. Apparently, if they're on the screen for 50 seconds, they get more aggressive. I don't know if that is the case on the Amiga version. And you don't want an aggressive gargoyle, that's for sure. But apparently they, they turn white when they get aggressive. Good idea about buying Dizzy Collection. Yeah, I'm... I used to have, it was called the Big Six. I used to have that for the CD32. But with regret, I sold it. I wish I hadn't. Unfortunately, I can't buy it again because it goes for stupid money. Graham would love that. Yeah, well, the only game, I, the only Dizzy game I completed is Prince of York Folk. Don't get that. That's the worst weapon. Why did I do that? Never mind. Take a key for coming in. I request Rick Dangerous. Yes, okay, I'll see what I can do. Hopefully it is on the go set. The first one definitely is. Out of the two, I think I've played the first one the most. But it's up to you. I can do UG after this one, or after Cannon Fodder, or after Venus of Fire Trap. It's entirely up to you. I just want to try and get through all the as many of requests as I can. I don't like being behind. I want to try and... I don't like missing any. Aggressive. No, you don't want an aggressive gargoyle, do you? Now these ones... They... When they attack you, they go at ground level. So you have to shoot them in the crouching position. I mean, even those birds, I used to struggle with those at first, but I seem to be okay with them now. At your age, not your hoof size. Mm. Uh, uh, 
what have you can Oh, hang on a Um, Graham would love that. Sounds like an... Sounds like an... After an hour of play. What... Oh, aggressive. Yeah. What have you... Have... What have you not completed? Treasure Island Dizzy. No, I've not played that one. Um, what game have you enjoyed playing the most on your stream? Personally, I enjoy G-Generation and Flashback the most. Actual Rage, not good. Flashback and Golden Eye. Hard, I think the generation and Golden Eye. Uh, might go Sega next. Cool, guys. Yes, I'm, I'm going to do a, a Mega Drive stream. Still trying to find that right day. Um, I did get a message from Pete early in, uh, last weekend. He said that um, Adrian is actually free this today. But I, unfortunately, I had to say no because obviously I've already promised the viewers that I was going to do the Amiga. So it's, it's proving quite tricky. Ugh. Close again. Uh, Treasure Island Dizzy, that was actually the first Dizzy game I played. That was the very first one. And that's going back some years. IK Plus, I was dying. <laughs> it is a funny game. I don't know if you can actually complete IK Plus. You just go up and belt, but I don't know if you actually can if you actually finish it. Apparently there is another belt after Black Belt, but I've never got there. I've only got to Black Belt 6. I think that is the best I've done. No, Jamie, you're an Amiga man. I am indeed. Commodore! I am a Commodore man. I mean, look at, I mean, oh, ah, hello, uh, hello, hello, it's working now, excellent, that's weird, that was, wasn't it, I'm oh, glad it's working, what did, what did you do in the end, what did you do, thanks for tuning in, yeah, thanks, it was nice, it was nice to see you the other day, that's great, yeah, I, they cooked me a lovely dinner on, um, on Tuesday, so I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. It was nice to see you. We played a bit of darts, and I got my first 180. Uh, sorry, 140. No, 120. Yeah, 140. Sorry, I got there in the end, didn't I? Yes. It was just luck. It wasn't skill. It was just luck. Ugh. Oh, hold on. Um, was lovely to see you Tuesday. Yes, I do it more often. You have to come around here as well. That'd be good. Uh, okay, plus in fast, okay, plus in fast motion is a laugh for sure. It's crazy. Might also have to have a one-off thing soon with big PUGP player. He's too good. Yes, I mean, if I could play online, you know, you have to play online with you with that if you want. For a stream, that'd be good. If that's what you mean. Right. Right, we meet again, Gargoyle. And he's taking my armor again! But yes, and um, Lee, you're definitely right. I do need a, an assistant, especially when the stream is this crazy. But I'm not complaining. This is brilliant. Right. Unfortunately, I don't. I don't like that crucifix weapon. I, I tried it last night. I don't, I don't like it. It's got hardly any range to it. Okay. Let's get that armor back. Really need that armor back. There we go. I mean, this level is definitely a banana skin. It's 
really, really difficult, this one. Mm. Ah! I'm going to shoot! Love you all! I love you too! I, if I remember, correct, the crucifix need a few hits on the enemies. Yeah, but it only goes about that far. I need something with a long range. I mean, these gargoyles only take three hits. It doesn't kill them with one shot, but, you know, the, but the, the range is, is poo. Unless it's, the, unless it's different on other versions. That was rubbish. Oh my word. Uh, Raw, yes, he texted me earlier. He said he's going to some retro event tomorrow, so he's going to have to get up early. So he said he was going to have an early night, and he said he watch. He might watch it in bed. He's probably falling asleep, yes. Well, I said to him, uh, please take some photos, because I'm intrigued of what this event is. Anything that's got retro in the name is always uh, interesting. That's the best weapon. That is the one you got to go for. The daggers. The daggers. It's quite a fast weapon. Right. Ah, daggers are fast. Yeah, it's 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 the best weapon by a long shot. But yeah, this is a real banana skin. This level, it's really difficult. Yes, he's a cool guy. His art is amazing. Yeah, you're, you're all cool. Everyone's cool. Oh! Uh, I, if I if I remember correct, uh, yes, I'll read that one. Mm hmm. Where's that gargoyle gone? Yes, I'll take that. I really want to get past this level. Right. See, sometimes they're okay, like that. But there we go. Avoiding ya. Now, I do wonder if that armor is still going to be there. I hope so. I hope it's going to be there. No, it's not. It's not there. It didn't turn up this time. Ah, oh, that's a poo. <laughs> Favourite 64 games. When they work, um, I don't know, I have a think. I have a think. Actually, it's time for a question. Time for a question. Um, obviously, last week's questions I didn't do because... Well I, I, well, I did pick three questions, but I didn't put them on because people really didn't know 
a lot about the C6 uh, PS1s. There we go. What uh, what game have you played the most on different platforms? So basically, what, what I mean is, you know, what game, what single game have you played like on Amiga, C64, the most versions of a, of a certain game? Hopefully that makes sense. See, mine's our type. Yeah, that's quite an easy one to answer. I've played it on the Amiga. I've played it on the Xbox 360. I've played it on Xbox One. I've played it on PC. I've played it on Master System. I've played it on SNES, Game Boy Color. So I've played it. I've played many versions. So that's mine. But what are yours? Hurricane, C64, and Amiga. Yeah, I've not played any other versions other than the Amiga. I've not played C64, but you did mention, you did text me yesterday, didn't you, or today, that you want to get the, uh, the C64 version? Ah, come on, Jamie. Probably FIFA. Yeah. There are lots of FIFAs. Yeah, I've played it on the Mega Drive. Actually, I've got I've got a Mega Drive version. And SNES. I don't have a lot of SNES, SNES games, unfortunately. Oh my word. Jasper's here! He's here, but he's not going to show himself on the camera, is he? Camera shy again. Right. I've got no more lights. No, I don't want that. I want my daggers. And still there, he's followed me all that way. Killed him straight away. Why does that happen? Yes! Yes! Right, come on, baby. I've got a feeling this is going to be a bit frustrating. I've got a funny feeling I'm going to finish it this time, but I've got no lives. Unfortunately, you've got to kill this guy before the boss because it just—it's—it's it's a struggle. Otherwise, right, boss battle. Come on, Jamie. I told you. I mean, I told you, didn't I? Finally got past it. Look at my lights. Got zero. Not good at all. Never mind. No, I suppose uh, Minecraft is even. You've only got it on one, haven't you? I tell you what, that could be PC, PC Minecraft, Xbox Minecraft, probably mobile Minecraft. There we go. I'm guessing that could be yours. Right, next level. Now, this one's a bit. That's these random platforms. But these platforms, they push you off. So you've got to time it, time it well. Right, so obviously you have a time limit, which is killer. Ah, you see? <laughs> it pushes you off. How mean of them. 
trouble is this is taking up a lot of time. Got to get it perfect timing. Ah, you see? Time is bad, Jamie. Time is bad. Of course, the level would not be complete with your gargoyle as well. There has to be a gargoyle. And I just jumped into him. Oh, I've gained two lives! I've gained two lives! That's nice. That's very nice. PlayStation, Minecraft and Mobile Minecraft. You know me well. Of course! Of course. What am I doing?! Rob, Rob, Roblox. Yeah, I've heard about that. Not my sort of thing, but I suppose I've... Try it, you, you know, might like it if you try it. I cannot believe I did that. That was such a silly mistake. Oh. Oh no! Wonder Boy, C64 Master System. Yeah, I've got. Yeah, I've got Masters. I've got I've got Wonder Boy. Um, anyway, you mentioned my favourite C64 games. Um, I love um, Beachhead 2, which I have done a video for. I'm going to upload that this weekend. Bruce Lee, um, um, Slimy's Mine. I love that. Um, Wonder Boy. Um, Delta, R-Type, Enforcer, Henry's House, there's quite a few I like really. I don't know what my actual favourite is, probably Impossible Mission. It's quite a few. Well played Jamie, it's a really hard game. Yeah, should I do one more or should I play the next game? Should I play UG first or should I play Venus Flytrap first? But this is not going to end here. Well, it might end here, but it's not going to end here. I'm going to do some more practice. I'm going to have some more practice, and I'm going to have a long play of this game. Well played, Gemma. I believe you can build a rocket and fly to the moon. Hug first. Okay. Now, Ugg. I assume it's pronounced Ugg. I've only actually played a demo. I haven't played the full game. So I don't know a lot about it. I know who it's made by. But that's all I know. Anyway, someone mentioned how my Jasper was. When you see him, he's fine. He's good. He's been a good boy. He usually sits here. But he hasn't the last couple of streams. However, the other day, um, there we go. He was sitting right there. Poser, isn't he a poser? <laughs> yeah, he's, he's a good, he's a good cat. He has his bad moments occasionally, but he's usually a good cat. But yeah, he's he's always outside. He doesn't really sort of come in at this time of day. Yeah, bless him. You remember Ugg, do you? Ugg, Ugg, Ugg. Yeah, I had a demo, but that was years. That was going back a lot of years. A lot, a lot of years. <laughs> ah. So. What games has people been playing recently? Oh, actually, I haven't posted this in a group yet, have I? Sorry, guys. Well, I don't know why I'm saying sorry. It's my mistake. It's my... Um, 
You might hear, I always say this, you might hear a slight echo. Uh, Obviously, if I don't post it to pages, I'm not going to be noticed. Is there, is there music playing? No. Come in, get fed and sleep all day. Lovely life. Well, I've actually got... I've got a, his treats here. So that, that will bring him in if he hears it. And all I have to say is the word treats. The vine is, is nearby, he'll come in. <laughs> so if he wants to come in and be sociable, he's... Well, he'll get some treats if he does. Um, let's post this in a few groups. Hold on, hold on. All week play Nicky Boom on Amiga. Very good platform. I've never played that. Hold on guys, sorry. Paste. Post. Is there, is there music playing? Yes. Um, I've heard the soundtrack. Never heard of that Swedish house. We'll check it out as I, as I love a good platformer. Right, well, I just have to tweak this picture. Hold on. Obviously, these games, they have uh, different size screens. Uh, Darth, it's, well, it's, it's not a Darth question. Darth question, Swedish house, but do you live in Sweden? I think he does. I think he does. There we go. Um, just before the stream started, I played Pac-Man. I love Pac-Man. Pac-Man's good. I've got um, I've got some Lego characters up there of Pac-Man. Um, I'm not going to keep getting up there. I'm going to try not to keep doing that. Um. Uh, yeah, Lee, correct. Good. Yes. Yes, because he is an hour forwards. Lee, you mentioned... Um, a very good platform. Uh, we'll check it out as I, I love a good platform. Here we go, I'll do my next question now then. Hold on. There we go. What are your top three game genres? There we go. So obviously Lee's probably answered one of them. It's very difficult to try and think of different questions each week. Obviously based around games, it's quite difficult. This is a demo. Yeah, I don't know how... I don't I know absolutely nothing about this. The only way I can describe it, it's basically Crazy, crazy Taxi, but in prehistoric. Gondio is in the UK. <laughs> that I do know. Fighting Puzzle Maze. That could be one game, couldn't it? A fighting Puzzle Maze game. I do like a racing car game. Two more, my friends. I'm in the UK. He is indeed. Mine is... Well, I'm sure you can probably answer that. Is Shoot 'em Ups platformers and probably puzzles, I imagine. There's mine. I'm not in strategy games, I have to admit. I do like racing games, but in terms of old school old racing games, I can't finish any of them. There's not many. I don't think I don't think I've actually finished any Amiga games that are racing ones. Right, this I don't know how long this is gonna be, probably not very long. This is my first proper try of this game. Right, introducing platforms. Obviously you get passwords. Okay. Time for some wine in a minute, I reckon. 
Oh, hang on, we've got an issue. Hold on. Try and get the whole picture in. There we go. Modern ones. So basically you have to pick up the characters and take them to where they want to go, but you've got to do it in the time limit. And you can't have them on board for too long. Uh, platform, adventure, and shoot them up, I guess. Oog. So he wants to go to door number one. What have you got? I assume there is a time limit, I don't know. There's an energy bar down the bottom. And obviously, don't hit them because they'll fall into the water. And that's not going to be good, is it? You wouldn't get you want you wouldn't want that in a taxi, would you? Yeah, take me here, but don't drop me in the water. Modern ones are so good on Dirt Four at the moment. Yes, I ha I bought that, but I haven't played it yet. It's on my list. Ook. Best rate, uh, best Mega Racer, Lotus, and Vroom. Yes, I need to play Lotus One and Three. I've only played two. There we go. There we go. Awesome. Right, level two. Introducing Bird. Not so good, I think. It's it's not bad. A lot better racing games, but it's not bad. I did play it on a, uh, on my streams, but I didn't do particularly well. But it was my first time. Formula One better. Right, so obviously we got to watch out for the the bird, but I don't think it's a bird. It's a is it a pterodactyl? Ooh. So I don't know how many levels there are. Um, I really don't know a lot about it, really. I mean, the graphics look good. Uh, right, he needs to go to here. No second prize is good too. Motorbike racer. Where does he want to go? He wants to go to two. There we go. Obviously, guys, I mentioned it on a few streams already, but when I get to 200 subscribers, which might take a while, but you never know, I'm going to do a quiz. Um, and obviously, the winner will get a prize. But I need to crack on with some questions, really, because that's, that's the sort of thing that could creep up on me uh, in no time. Because I couldn't believe how quickly I got to 100, so I think I need to start planning it, planning for it, really. Introducing Funny Water. No screen price. Psygnosis. Psygnosis are brilliant. I do like Psygnosis. Psygnosis, um, Team 17, and Bitmap Brothers are my favourite. Right, so now... Oh, so okay, so you mustn't hit the sides, okay? So I've learned, I'll, I'll learn from that. Lee, do you sleep? Well, hopefully he does. Hopefully he's not sleeping now. Ook. So don't hit the walls. Not a lot of room for error. So you drop him off. Pick the next one up. He wants to go to the same door. Unfortunately, I've only got room for one person. Obviously, a party in there somewhere, I reckon. Not enough. <laughs> well, you're not. Hopefully, you're not working this weekend, so you can catch up on your sleep. Oh, I do you know. What? I've only just noticed the water is increasing. 
Quite a lot, actually. No failure in Swedish house. Yes, Palin did um, 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 let Lionheart, didn't it? And Lee, I um, you mentioned another Falion game, some sort of shoot 'em up. I have actually got that on my GoTech, but I haven't played it yet. Something like, is it Theatre of Death or something like that? So I will try that out at some point. Probably won't be this stream, but I will get on it. Right. Whoa! Don't fall in the water. Okay. I like the sleeping dragon, uh, sorry, dinosaur on the right there. I'm guessing you've got to creep past him. Right, he needs to go up here. Ooh. Right, he needs to go to number three, so I've got to go through, past the water, past the sleeping dinosaur. This could be fun. Excellent graphics in this game. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? I like I like the little characters. That's good. It's a nice touch. I said I don't know a lot about it, to be honest with you. I think it was done by Blue Byte, which Playbite, sorry, which were the same people that did Apodia or Pidia, however it's pronounced. See, I need my energy is low. Get him! Get him! I don't know where you get energy from. Quickly! He's an old man, but hurry up! Ah, oh, was this going too fast there? Dino. His name is Dino. Good name for a dinosaur. So obviously, do it again, but quicker. But just don't fly into anything. Right, he needs to go up here. I'm guessing the closer to the door the possible as possible. Get in! I'm not sure what that does. Oh, okay. That's how you get health. You drop the stone on the tree, and the tree drops the apple. Look at the size of that apple, that's a big apple. Okay. So just be a bit more gentle here, Jamie. I've got someone on board, and he wants to go here. Blue Bite made Yojo, I think, too. Yes, uh, yeah, Yojo's good. I've got that. Can't get very far on it, though. Let's try that again, shall we? I've got a banana. Oh, okay, I've got loads of health now. I'm guessing if you hit that dinosaur, he'll wake up. Oh, okay. First Samurai as a suggestion, Jamie. Yes, I need to play that. Probably won't be able to fit it in this stream. I've got quite a few to do. Which is why I'm probably going to try and keep this... This one, this, this one I probably won't spend much time on. 
We'll lock the fit in. But, 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 I have figured out the problem with this YouTube business of why it's not uploading all of it. I figured it out. I know exactly what to do. It's a pain, but if I keep doing it, it will, there won't be an issue. Basically, when the stream has finished, oh, I don't know how it's happening, but YouTube are only uploading two hours. But there is a but there is a setting you can you can change, and it says refer to original. You click on that, and then it will say processing. And then, obviously, it'll. I'm guessing YouTube will process it, and then you'll get the full video. So it's a bit strange, but it it works. At least I'm not losing the whole video. It might, yeah, it might take a while, but obviously overnight it can do it. So by the time I wake up in the morning, it should be done. Quickly, get in, get in! I ain't gonna do this. Wow, so I love it! Woohoo! Take stone and get energy. Yes, I figured it out now. Obviously, when you're carrying a stone, you can't. No one can go in. You've got to be tactical. Okay. Uh, have you completed this then before Swedish House? Obviously, we've got. A, I'm guessing we've got to avoid the dinosaur. Oh, I just knocked you into the water. Swim. I don't think I'm going to get a tip from this. Um. Yeah, he's angry. Well, that's mean, isn't it? Do you have to drop the stone on the dinosaur, do you think? I do wonder. If you do. I'm going to try it. Let's try hitting the dinosaur with the stone. And see what happens. Ha ha! Take some of that! How far have you got then? So many levels. Ah, one well, of those ones, is it? Yeah, you've got to be quite tactical, haven't you, really, by the sound by the looks of it. Um. Oh, I knocked him in the water! And obviously you've got to get that down there quickly, because they drown, I guess. Fun... Funny drop stone on dino, yes, I don't like the sound. <laughs> Three. There we go. Let's do it again, shall we? <laughs> did he see that coming, did he? I'm guessing, I'm guessing a hundred levels. Uh, one. That energy goes very quickly. Boom! There we go. Level six, diving. So how's your week been, Swedish House? How, you, how has it been? 
To be honest, not remember how far I got. Not played this for many years. I had a demo. That's that's it. Where that demo went, I don't know. I don't have it anymore. Oh, this is interesting. I got a funny feeling you've got to dive under the water and do that. Am I right? So this girl is going to get a bit soaked. Oh, so about that. Ooh. She liked it so much, she wanted another go. Woohoo! I'll do a few more, and then I'm going to put the next game on. Try to fit as many video, uh, mini videos, as many games as I can. I mean, it's now, it's, it's gone from past the hour mark already. It goes so quick. Look. Um. Just need to try and get a bit quicker at it. Where she wanna go? Uh, four. Door number four. Time. Time? What do you mean time? A little bit reminds me of Lemmings in some way. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Right. Energy flies when you're having fun. That is very true. I said I did, I did, I did enjoy it last week's stream, but it definitely had an effect. It really did. I mean, when I when I hit that go live button, um, Swedish House obviously commented first, and um, but yeah, it, it took about it, it took a good sort of. 10-15 minutes until we finally got some response. Alright, I'm going to put that there. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh, what do you mind? I was actually very, very surprised. I, I, I thought it was going to be quite popular. But, um, I'm guessing not. And I had some PlayStation 1 questions, and uh, yeah, I was quite surprised that people didn't really own or have PS4 uh, 1 games, so it was interesting. But Amiga is the way. I would like to do a C64 stream. I might actually do a C64 stream when I get my uh, C64 Mini. Um... To be honest, I'm, I might be going to Maidstone tomorrow. That's in Kent with with Pete, and uh, I just got I got paid today, so I might I might go I might buy one tomorrow because there's quite a few games I want to play, and I can't I can't get access to them. There's quite a few games that aren't playing at the moment. I was because I, I was doing those videos early in the week, and some of my games I kept crashing. I got the video done in the end, but there's also quite a few games that I want to do, but which, have, which I've got on my floppy disk version, but my floppy disk drive isn't working, so I need to try and get them some other way. And obviously I want to do Sam's Journey, and I want to do Beachhead, no, Bruce Lee 2. Right, I'm going to make this the last one, guys, if that's alright with you. Let's say it's a good game, but I want to try and fit more videos in. Uh, so he wants to go to one. Let's try and get a bit quicker. Whoa! Whoa, the water! 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 
just gonna drown. Yes, do it. You can download Rims. What's Rims? Rims, Rims, Rims. Roms. Aha. Yeah, there's quite a few games I want to play. I really want to play that uh, Aztec Challenge. I, I reckon I could do that. That uh, they were playing right retro gaming. Right, this is the last one, guys. Oh my word! Don't annoy the dinosaur. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but my, I've got an issue with my. I don't know if it's getting if it's getting too hot or what. So I'm not sure, but I was trying to load uh, Beachhead Two the other day to do my video, and it kept. You know, going back to the main menu. So I've actually got two C64s. So I was actually swapping between the two and I was swapping tape decks and see what was the best way, but couldn't figure out what the issue was. I still can't, still don't know what the issue is. <laughs> yes. Yes, I know. I know. I, yeah, that's, that's a normal thing. It's like in the old days, you know, like I said before. Is uh, yeah, we, we say last go. <laughs> Hold on. Still think ours had lag. Yeah, it was it was weird, wasn't it? Obviously, the viewers can't really see that. Um, I mean, I do get a slight lag on the um, not on the game, but on the. If I'm doing a video, for example, um, you get a slight delay with a webcam. So I might say something at a certain point, and then a, a couple of seconds later, it will come out. So it doesn't go with the footage. It's not a big deal, but um, if you're doing an edit or something, then yes, it's, it can be a bit of an issue. Right! That's it. I'm going to leave it there, guys. I'm going to put the next game on. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm going to play Venus the Flytrap next, um, which is a great game. But yeah, I'll stick with that. I'll, I'll keep. I'll actually write that. If I write that password down or cheat and use a uh, camera, that's the only way I'm going to cheat. That's for sure. Whoops. So level ten. There we go. Uh, horsepower failed you. I won't mention what, what the other games I want to play are on my C64, because you have to wait and see what they are. First level should not be that hard. I think it was to do how Ant captured the picture or something. Yeah. Yes, the reason why I really want to play it, because obviously, well, there's a few reasons. One, it's a brilliant game. Two, I love bugs. And three, I made a hammer bead uh, of it. So that really might really play. Actually, I put it on here now. Obviously, I can't show you the the actual hammer bee because it's green, and the green screen will will cut it out. Um, there you go. I made that. I made that last weekend. I'm really chuffed for that. I'm really really chuffed. I didn't copy anyone. I didn't copy anybody. Um, I literally just got the image on Google, took a screenshot, zoomed in on it, and then made it. But yeah, I'm really chuffed how that came out. Really, really chuffed. And after I, after I finished that, I thought, yep, I want to play it now. Yeah. I've got the game here. I've got the box here. There you go. It's a brilliant game. That's actually got green in it, and it's behaving itself. That's, that's, that's unusual. Came out in... Huh. Oh, 1990. Nice art, thank you. Oh, hello, uh, Mad Moments Go. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah, I was quite, I was chuffed with that. How are you doing, Mad Moments Go? I'm gonna leave the intro playing, and uh, yeah, it's a good game. It's quite a long game, but it is a good game. But I won't complete it today. But I might do a video for it. Some of these games do take a long time to finish. Oh, my tea's gone cold. Still forget though. Like. Yeah, grim and good. For countless millennia, a haven of life 
in a barren galaxy. But in the space of a few centuries, man ruined the paradise created for him. Good, good, good song this one, by the way. A fast multiplying population coupled with a greater de demand on agriculture like, led to the overdose, over, overuse of pesticides and destruction of the rainforests. Sorry, but my reading is not brilliant. It should be, because it's English. Mother Earth was fighting a losing battle. The final outcome was inevitable. In an attempt to correct the e ecological balance, a group of scientists created a race of cybernetic insects. But an error in their genetic makeup caused them to go insane, killing any living creature they found and wiping out the remains of the Earth's devastated forests. Something had to be done. Exactly. And that's where we come in. Uh, that, that, do you know what? I'm quite tempted to make that as a, as a hammer bead as well. I mean, I think that's going to be quite huge. That would be massive. Because uh, there's a lot of pixels there. So I think that's going to be huge. Or maybe get a poster. I'd love to get a, some mega posters on my wall. I mean, that would be stunning, I think. Yeah, the time has come. It's Friday. It's Friday. Insert this too. Right, let's try and post this in a few more groups. Again, you might hear an echo. I'm trying to think what other groups there are. Pardon me. The more the better. The more the better. Press fire, Jamie. Speaking of Grimling, have you tried Space Crusade? Yes, I have it here. Yes. Uh, I've also got a demo down here as well. Where'd that go? Yeah. There you go. There's a game on here, I don't know if you can see it, it's called Zone of Zeus. Now, I don't think that was actually released, it's only on the demo, but I'm going to try and play that, because that was a good game. Um, but yes, yeah, Space Crusade was on that disc, and that was actually the first time I played it. So yeah, I bought it, and my green screen is going weird. I've noticed that if I move my arms around, my green screen goes weird. Um, so I can't move, I'm not allowed to move, obviously. Uh, Hold on. I can't affect this... Ooh. Oh! Hold on, you're gonna see my green screen for a moment. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Can be a right nuisance sometimes, this green screen. And I had to put this on. Uh, I didn't have it on because obviously this Amiga logo has got slight green on it and as you can see it's blanked it out so that's why I had to put the shirt over I didn't want to to cover up the Amiga but yeah the green is powerful it's a powerful screen finished it Jamie or Lee um, which one are you referring to Space Crusade um, yes played it uh, yes I played it Swedish House love the two player mode when you blew you up mate and um, I think once I did finish a level. I don't know if it's lots of levels, but yeah, is it the, ju the is it the Juggernaut or something? I'm not sure. What's it called? A big massive thing, Dreadnought. I did I did blow up the Dreadnought once. But yeah, it's a good game. I can do that as well. But the trouble is that's quite a slow a slow game. Played this a few weeks ago on the Amiga emulator. Good game. Yeah. I like bugs. I like bugs. Is it too loud? Obviously I can't tell from your side of your side of things. Right. I say it look it looks great and it's also got a, a flying some flying levels as well. 
Right, you got you got add you got add credits. There we go. How's your week been, Mad Moments Go? How you been? Twenty-eight years ago, this game. Oh, twenty-eight years old. This game, and still awesome. Yeah, it's very good. It's very good. To be honest, I had I, I had a bit a few problems in the old days because I didn't actually realise that you can actually select through your weapons because uh, when you start getting weapon upgrades, your ammo starts to sh starts to go. And the further you progress into the level, the levels, you start getting three ways and five ways. And of course, if you shoot one five way, that's five bullets goes. So I always thought that once your f weapons go, you're out, you're out of bullets. I used, to, I used to keep really trying to be tactical. And you get to, and then I did realise that when you you go to zero, you can actually switch back to your original weapon, and that you have unlimited of. So I didn't know that. Anyway, the Forbidden Forest. So there's there is the character that I made. So there we go. But yes, it looks really, really good. Fine. Good stuff. But yes, this weapon here, you basically have unlimited bullets, so there's no issues. You only get the weapon, uh, the ammo, when you get a different weapon. Like that one, it's now gone up to 50. But then, this only takes one hit. And obviously, if your ammo gets low, just go back to normal again. But you can get extra ammo. And obviously, you have a time limit. So, I need to watch that for that. Oh, and you get time limit increases. So, there we go. Yeah, space. Oh, hang on. That's energy. Quite a few games use that technique. That that flying heart. I know Zool did. There are a few. That that's ammo there. So we've got 62 at the minute. So that's all right. Yeah, space you say would take a 10-hour stream to really. I had no idea it'd be as long as that. How many levels are there then? I've got the board game, the old school board game, and I've also got uh, Heroes Quest as well as a board game, but I've never played Heroes Quest on the Amiga before. See, when you've got this weapon, you can just you can go for it pretty quick. Obviously, some enemies do still take quite a few hits. Oh, that was Grimling as well, was it? Oh, right. yeah, Grimling. Yeah, I didn't realise. That came out in 1991. And obviously you get different icons on the ground. That one I think makes you bounce. Like that. The only thing I would probably change about this game is the boss battles. Um, I think it needs it needs better bosses. Obviously you've got that flying <clears throat> snake thing which um, when you're flying in the air, you get that, but that, but then that's not really technically a boss, really. But it needs it needs something e extra. That's the only thing I'd change. But in saying that, I don't know what happens at the end. I've never finished it. There might be a big, big a big boss at the end. But yes, keep keep giving me requests. Obviously, um, can't do them all today. But for future for future um, streams, obviously, I want to do what the viewers want to see. 
But yes, I will get Beast 2, hopefully finish one day, Lee. Well, I suppose it all depends how far he's, he's not online. If, it's, if he's um, away for some time, they're obviously chatting for a very, 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 very long time. What did he say? That's quite interesting. What did he say earlier? Stay single, everybody. Did he say that? Yeah, I'm sure he said that. And now he's, he's chatting with some girl on uh, online. And also, why do people call girls birds? I never understood that. Birds. Yeah, me and my bird. So if that's if you call your girlfriend a bird, what do you call a bird? I don't know. Never really understood that one. Anyway, I'm gonna try and get through this as quickly as I can because it obviously it is a bit samey. But obviously I want to try and fit as much as, as much as I can into this video. Bird. Yeah, people tend to call their girlfriends birds. Yeah, me and my bird, we went and did we went out and did this and Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I've ever said that. But in saying that I haven't had I haven't really had a lot of girls in my life, but I don't call them birds. I call birds birds and girls girls. Or women. He, he did. Because he's still 15 years old. <laughs> he's a big kid. Whoa! Right, now we go for a little change. Obviously bugs, you know the deals with bugs. They can walk up walls and ceilings, and that's exactly what we're doing here. We're on the ceiling. And obviously when you're on the ceiling, your controls are reversed. He did say that, Jamie. Contracting himself. Contradicting himself, yes. <laughs> yes, he was a girl in his life, he does. Whether he'll change, whether Anthony would actually change uh, if he does get a girlfriend, I'm not sure. He might have to mellow out a little bit. Unless she likes that sort of thing. I don't know how many girls would probably like boyfriends doing this sort of thing. Not sure. Certainly wouldn't be able to do it as much if you had a girlfriend in your life. Obviously, don't fall down there, because you'll be stuck. Right, this one I'm going to take a hit. Right. Is this the flying level? No, no, not yet. It can't be. Can't be, can't be. Right, I've got some wine. Time for wine. Forbidden Forest, area four. I can't remember how many areas there are. I'm going to say five. It's probably wrong. So anyway, Lee, how's life treating you? How's everything? How's the family? What was the last new game you played? No, I, I, I doubt it too. Whoops. Need some health. See, that's... <laughs> that tends to happen quite a bit. If you're not nearby, it will go off without you. Need some energy.
Hey, ammo is fine. Time is fine. Health is not fine. Look at that! Look at that! Now it's even worse. I don't know if your health re replenishes at the end of levels. I'm not sure. Obviously you get a time bonus for every time you have left. Which is nice. I'm going to guess that this is the last one. I'm going to say there's five. All good, thanks, Jamie. Last minute game I played was Assassin by Team 17. Yes, I've got it over there. Can't get past the second level. No, your health does not replenish. I understood you. I understood you. Yeah, there's not many Team 17 games I have finished, really. Also, have you noticed that Team 17 have actually changed their logo? Have you noticed that? To be honest, I think I prefer the old one. But like I said last stream, it's, you know, it's their decision. Their decision. Come on, I need some energy. Energy, please. Whoa, I'm gonna die. Assassin with those hungry dogs that want to eat you. Yeah, they bite your legs. Whoa. Yeah, I agree. I totally agree. It was a bit of a surprise, to be honest. That's one. I need more than one. Oh, got one up. Brilliant. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, a bit, it's a bit strange, really, when you... Because obviously you've been used to it for so long. I mean, imagine, like, the Bitmap Brothers. Imagine if they changed theirs. Everyone knows them by the hands, you know? It'd be weird if that would suddenly change, you know? The Bitmap Hand. Need some energy. Obviously, those ones drain your time, which I very really, really landed on. That's gonna be one. I bet you. I told you. Um, uh, oh, uh, well, I'll try and, sh I'll try and get a picture of it. Yes, a new, t had a lovely high res purple logo, yes, I'll, I'll, I'll look for it in a minute, yes. Loading. Cheers guys! Oh we go, bonus level. Cheers guys! Happy Friday! Great to have you all back again. I absolutely really really love doing these streams. It's really really good. It's nice to have something to look forward to. I mean having the set time really really does help. It's a massive difference. But um... Oh, I love it. It's just really good. There's still a few things that I still I need to work on. Like getting my multi stream. I, I need to try and figure out how to multi stream. That is the way I've got to go. But I, just, I do wonder, worry that my laptop's not going to be able to cope. It's got to be an, e an easy way around it. And also, I've been trying to do um, st st uh, stream labs. Um, but every time I've tried, again, it goes wrong. My laptop can't cope. Now that is a shame because Streamlabs have a lot of extra stuff. Like it will tell you when you've got a subscriber, it will tell you when someone's following you, and you can add lots of extra stuff. You can add lots of effects to it, but I can't seem to do it on my laptop, so I've had to keep deleting it. 
I'm at that point now where I want to have like, uh, like if someone clicks on the subscribe button, it will come up, such and such has subscribed. That's what I want. Right, obviously this is the closest thing to a boss to this game, but um, it needs it needs a proper boss. I have to go, go, oh, okay, take an easy horse. Nighty night, my friends. I raise my glass to you. Got to go have a good rest of the stream. Bye all, night horse. Night horse. Bye Lee. Right. I'm going to have to go to the loo in a minute. Hold on. <laughs> I've, honestly, I've drunk so much. I, I, I've drunk two glasses. Since I got home, got home from work, I've had two glasses of orange juice, three cups of tea, uh, a glass of Coke, and, and some wine. It does go through me. No beer though, I'm not drinking any beer. The code for the frozen waste is Mandis. Mantit, Mantit, Mantids. Mantids. Right. I'm going to have to go to the toilet, guys. I really apologise. But check this out. Hold on. <laughs> Been playing around a little bit. There you go. I'll be back in a few minutes before. <laughs> I'm back. Should we try and get Jasper on the camera? Ready? Treats! Treats! Come on Jasper, treats! You're going to have to jump up here though. Come on. You can have them if you jump up here. Treats? You look sleepy. You can't keep your eyes open. Where have you been? Come on in. No, you jump up here. I'll put it there. Come on. There we go. Turn around. We don't want to see your bottom. He likes dreamies. <laughs> Can you actually hear him? Can you hear him making that noise? Crunchy, huh? smell the same. He's got like four different flavours. They all smell the same. But he loves them. Alright, alright. Good. One more. You have to work for it. Ready? This is the big one. There you go. There we go. There we go. Is that his treat? No, he's off. Where are you going now? That's your treat. This is mine. Come on, Jasper, show yourself. Come on. Let me camera show. Okay. Yubby yubby. Yes, he likes he likes his dreamies. Right, so here we go. Whoops. How do you unpause it? How do you unpause it? I've managed to pause it, I don't know how to unpause it. Actually, I can look at the box, if that makes sense. Oh, sorry Jasper, sorry, sorry, sorry. Whoa, sorry. No, I pressed the P, I pressed P for pause. Hold on. Restart. No, I don't want restart. That, that would lose a life. 
pause game is P. I've tried that. Ah! Cheers, come to you! How did you know that? It's not, it doesn't, it doesn't even say that in here. Huh. Oh! Cheers, mate! Oh, okay. Well, yes, I was technically, yes. Cheers, mate. What's the last game you played, Gumdio? Right, I've lost quite a lot of health already. Well, see, this time these enemies take more hits to kill them. Well, you should get the free shot this time, or the free way. And we have these spikes. Pac-Man! Oh, of course, yes, sorry, you, said, you did say, didn't you? Whoops, Jamie, pay attention. Obviously, the big heart fills it completely, the small heart is one. I'm quite tempted to show you my uh, Pac-Man Lego. Right, there's the freeway, and obviously, you know the deal's with freeway, one shot is three bullets, so... Don't use too many of them, because they all go. Oh no, that's a silly thing. I've gone too far. Oh no! What was self-destruct? It was help, wasn't it? I got stuck. The screen had moved on too far. I've lost that weapon. That's mean. Yeah, I do like Pac-Man. I've got quite a few different type, different versions. I've got obviously Pac-Man, Miss Pac-Man on the uh, Xbox. I've got Pac-Man World on PlayStation One. I've got um, Pac-Man Adventures One and Two on the 360. I've got Pac-Man Two Six Three, I think, on Xbox One. I've got. Uh, Pac-Man Championship. Quite a lot of different versions. Lots of different versions. I do like Pac-Man World. You played Pac-Man World. That's really good. That's on PlayStation One. Right, I've got the freeway back. I'll do a few more levels and then I'm going to put uh, cannon fodder on, as that was requested. And then we'll see what, how we are for time. I mean, it's, I think there's still plenty of time to put another game on after that, I'm sure. Whoopsie. Itchy nose. So what's everyone doing at the weekend? I don't think I've asked that question. What's everybody's plans? I've got the weekend off again. The occasional day of working does, does creep in, but this week was not required. I didn't do I didn't do any videos last weekend because uh, even though I had three days off, right now my my, my controls are now reversed. Okay. Um, I had three days off last week. But I was having a major tidy up at home. Um, and the trouble is, when you're in that zone, you do one job, and then you go on to something else, and then you go on to something else, and then you realise you've left it in a, me a mess, so you've got to finish it. So you just keep doing it, something else, something else, something else, and I can actually, I've got no time to do any videos. 
So I actually did a couple on Monday when I got home from work. I did Beachhead 1 and 2. I've uploaded 1, but 2 I think is better, a lot better. I'm, pr I'm proud of that one. The reason why I haven't done that one yet is because I wanted to do them in order. And obviously, and also the uh, the second one is, is a lot longer. It's, a very, it's quite a long video for a C64 game. But um, if you haven't played Beachhead 2, I think you're going to enjoy it. It's got really good sound effects, it's got lots of speech. And uh, it's a lot different to the first one. But I'll be uploading that probably tomorrow. Another reason why I didn't want to upload it yet is because obviously I don't want it to, you know, interfere with this one. Because obviously once this uploads, then I know that's done, I've got to worry about it, and then I'll upload the other one. But I'm going to try and get them some more completions this weekend. I really, really, really want to finish uh, Project X. Really want to do that. Now I've got this new zipstick, because obviously that other one was playing up. I sh that, should, that should help. But to be honest, as crazy as it probably sounds, even though I've just bought this one, I'm, I'm actually watching a couple more on eBay. I want to buy another one as a backup. I want to have a backup joy... Amount of Amiga that I'm playing at the moment, I want to have some backup uh, joysticks. It's, it's such a good joystick, but they are going. The, the price of these joysticks are now going up in value, so I want to try and get them while they're fairly cheap. Still. We have a big gun. Oh my word, it's gonna kill me. My health is terrible. Ah! Blew him to pieces! Right, trouble is when you die, you lose your weapon. Now I've got to try and kill this thing with a, a poo weapon. Obviously, when you lose your weapons, you, you're left with normal weapon. It does have a big effect. It takes a lot more hits, but you don't lose ammo for it. It's, it's not a, a very powerful weapon at all. But it's better than nothing. Some of these enemies do take a lot of hits with it. Whoa! Oi. Right. I might put cannon fodder on now. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? Ah, oh, so nice. It's going down too well though. Right, last level. <laughs> Done it again, didn't I? Last level. Whoops. I don't actually know how many people are watching, actually. I haven't checked. Oh, got the freeway again. Oh, they're shooting now. Ah! Got away. Got away. No, nope. I'm dead. I'm dead. Right, I'm going to put cannon fodder on now, guys. So I want to try and fit as many videos as possible. Free watching. Yeah. It's got a bit quiet. It's got a little bit quiet. But it's not going to stop me. I mean, I'm, it's very, very difficult to try and get people to notice you, notice your stream. I keep posting it in these groups, but I don't know if it's helping or not. But uh, this is why I want to try and figure out how to multi-stream. I really have I've got to be on 
YouTube and 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 Twitch. It's the way to go, but I know I know I really should be on Twitch. But more people use YouTube. It's like if you're doing a long play, for example. If people want to figure out how to complete a game, if they are watch watch a long play to see how we can figure out, they're not going to check Twitch. They'll check YouTube. So yeah. Right, unlimited bombs, unlimited missiles, unlimited men. No, absolutely not. What is this? They trained. What is what? What is this? They trained. Cannon fodder. First time I see this. Yeah, right. I've now this is going to be affected without a shadow of a doubt because it's green. But I've actually got two versions of this. That's actually not as well, that actually, that actually looks quite cool. Look at that. So I've got that version. And I've also got this version. This is on the CD32. That's not that's okay. A little well, a little bit affected. But uh, yeah. And the CD32 version does have a movie. Um But yes, war has never been so much fun, but it is very, very difficult. I don't, I don't again, I don't know how many levels I'm gonna do. Probably not that many, but I am gonna try and complete it on a video. But obviously we know how difficult this game can be, but I like a challenge. Now I did actually do do this around Anthony's uh, house on the stream, but he's got the most sensitive mouse I think I've ever used in my life. And it was really, really not doing it for me, I was struggling. But this mouse, I do like this mouse. So, we'll see. We will see. I'm going to leave this intro playing because it has such a great soundtrack. Hopefully everyone knows that. I actually, I actually bought myself another game, which actually arrived the other day. Now again, this is a game I've owned for a very, very long time, but I've never had a boxed version. But I bought this from Retro Pixels. I bought Sleepwalker. That actually cost me $9.99, and the condition is pretty much perfect, so I'm proper chuffed with that. But... Um, it's a great game, but it's very, very difficult. But I, I might get, I might try and do a video for that. But that was a great find. So thank you, Retro Pixels, for that. Right. While this is playing, let's try and post it a little bit more, shall we? Let's do Amiga again. Let's put streaming cannon fodder, shall we? Video from uh, the Sensible Soccer was also good. I haven't seen that. Not seen that. Do you know what? You, you keep mentioning. Um, um, sensible soccer. I actually did. I was actually that close. You ever, um, I think we should, no, yesterday or day before, I was looking on uh, on eBay and I found one. It was actually again. It looked in very very good condition. It was about thirty pound. I was really tempted to buy it, and I think I might still buy it. Yeah. Well, on my channel, I've actually got a a top ten music video, which was a um, a poll from Facebook, and I actually did. A video for it, and one of the one of the votes was Sensible Soccer, and I actually included the song on top of the gameplay. So, um, what I can do? I wonder if I can do it. Hold on. Bear with, bear with. I think I've got a message from Anthony. Hold on. Try and find it, and I post it if I can know if I know how to do it. There we go. I'll post it in the, in the chat. Hold on. Again, you might hear a slight echo. Hold on. 
It's got to be an easier way than this, surely. Again, you might hear a slight echo. Hold on. There you go. That's the link to the video. Now that actually does have the sensible soccer song. Because I, I, it was a poll that I put on Facebook, and people voted for their favourite games of all time, and what, and there was quite a big vote for sensible soccer. And of course, every single every every game in that list, I played some footage, and I included set of music, but I included the the, the the song over the gameplay for that video, so it's there. Right. another great tune this one is it does it sound okay is it too loud let me know if it's too loud and I'll turn it down but yeah I might I'm, I'm, I'm probably gonna buy it now I really want to it's, it's one of those games that keeps coming up in conversations so I really must buy it I've got it on the CC the CD 32 but not that version all right let's try and sort this oh, I've got two masses on the go now uh, let's try and sort this out hold on um, Try and make it a little bit bigger. Little tweak, that's all it needs. Yes, there is there's a video, yes. Yes there is. Right. Um Hold on, bear with. <laughs> A sensible initiation. So this is the part I really need to get a bit quicker at. Kill all enemy. Hold on. Kill all enemy. There we go. There's the video for the song. Right. With two soldiers, you must kill all, all the enemy. Seven, 13 recruits remaining. Very, very short level. There we go. I think this link has the lyrics. Well, I think we all know the. I think we all know the song, the lyrics. There's not many, but when we first heard it, we were like, "Wow, that is brilliant! Really, really good." Heroes in victory. Anyway, um, I'm trying to remember what other requests came through, but yeah, obviously, uh, any other games you want me to play after this, I'll see what I can do. But I think I'm probably going to do uh, a video for this, but it might take a while because it's quite a long game and a very, very hard game. But I do like a challenge. Okay, kill all enemy. The bridge over the river pie. I like pie. Now I speak about the other tune without lyrics here. John Harp here. Ah. Okay. Yes, yeah, sensible soccer, uh, sensible software are very, very good. I haven't played all of their games. I haven't played sensible golf. Obviously, I have played sensible soccer. I haven't played Cannon Fuller Two, which is quite surprising. Um, 
I think WizKid, that was uh, sensible. Was that sensible software as well? I'm not sure. Might be wrong on that one. I can't think what else they made. There's not many games I've played. Beautiful song. Yeah. This mouse is so much better than the one I was using around Anthony's. I mean, everybody's different. Oh, okay. Cheers. Everyone's different. Some people prefer other mouses, but this is the one for me. Because that one I played, it was so sensitive. All you had to do is just move it a fraction. It was like, whoosh, whizzes across the screen. And also, it just really, really over the top quick, this cursor. You don't get a lot of control. There we go. Obviously, I'll try and get through this as quickly as I can. Obviously, every stream I do, I always watch it back. And sometimes I do rub it on too much. I need to try and keep the gameplay flowing, really. Too much of this stopping play and faffing around. I need to try and just keep it, keep the play flow. Keep it flow. Go with the flow. That's what they tune in for, the, the, the footage, not the... The rap... Talking, chatting, Jamie, that I am. Brings people here, now five watching. Excellent. Yes. It's really it's really difficult to try and get your name noticed. Obviously I need to I need to do these schedule times and then post them with about a day prior to the you know like a day early, but I'm full, I, I don't have the confidence that everything's gonna work to do that. So I've tried it before and it failed. It failed twice. And there was a lot of issues with lagging and sound and the mic and everything, so I'm not quite confident enough to go for it but that's what I need to do I really know I really need to do that because people need to know when I'm doing it and I don't like putting all these links on during the stream I want to sort of do it bef you know before it starts really but I'm definitely 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 gonna do a video for this but it's not gonna be overnight you know it's gonna take a bit of time it's probably gonna be one of those games I have to do it keep doing a little bit save it do a little bit more, save it, and then eventually when it comes to editing, I'll put it all together. And hopefully we'll have a, a good video. Because I don't know anyone that has finished it. That was actually quite risky, because you can get blow uh, killed by the door. Oh! Oh, that's my glass. <laughs> right. Um, five now watching. I mean, this game is absolutely brilliant. It's it's great fun, but it, it is the bazookas that are the pain. When I get to the bazooka stages, they are so difficult because they're so accurate. That's where all your tactics change. Obviously, we've got a lot more recruitments. Now, I don't know if there is a maximum amount of recruits. I don't know. And obviously, each person that, you know, survives, obviously, you're up in rank. Yeah, bang, bang, you're dead level. It's very, very hard. Yeah. Is that the first level? Well... I don't know what level it is when the bazookas start coming into play, but I'm dreading it already, if we go that far. But obviously I want to try and fit as many videos as I can. But any more requests, please do do so. I can't remember what Lee said, I'm sure Lee mentioned one, mentioned one earlier. I can't remember what game, he, what game he said now. I suppose I could scroll through the chat, hold on. Mind you, that's probably going back some way. Oh, Wit Dangerous. It's of course, yes, Wit Dangerous. I'll see if I've got that. Um, Is this the level of the cannon in the middle? No, it's not. Don't think, I don't think so. 
Didn't think that was working for a minute there. No, I don't think so. No. Obviously, we don't have any grenades. Don't shoot the grenades. I'm sure many people have made that mistake. Obviously, watch out for that roof, because that can kill you as well if it lands on you. Obviously, it's random each time. The door can fly off, that can kill you as well. And obviously the blast from the grenades. Ten grenades. We've got to kill all the enemy and blow up all the buildings. Okay, right, come on people, walk this way. Need a good mouse to control the vehicles. Yeah, I mean, this, is, this, is, this, is, this is a good mouse. It's not an official Amiga mouse. That one broke. But it's a good mouse. And it works. Look after your mouse and it will work for you. I've got a lot, I mean, I, I, as I mentioned in, my, in the stream earlier, um, I do like my puzzle games. There's quite a few games, I've, puzzle games that I've got which use, which use mouse. I love Bill's Tomato game, I love Logical, that's another great game. But yeah, you def definitely need a, a good working mouse. Obviously they do fill up with gunk and get your, get your cotton buds out and get all the fluff out of it. Go well! Right, let's read Anthony's message, shall we? Oh, he sent me a picture. <laughs> okay. Heroes in victory and lemmings, of course. Yes, you do need a very, very good working mouse. Again, it's number one of those games. Yes, it's... It's definitely doable, but you're going to need a lot of time to do it. Yes, who doesn't like lemmings? I'm sure some people don't like lemmings, but... I've got loads of different versions of lemmings. Super Smashing Nantastic. Where's Lee gone? Where's Lee? Lee, where are you? Destroy the enemy buildings, bitchy head. Phase one of four. So you don't have to kill all the enemy on this one, just the buildings. Quarter past 11, so it's quarter past 12 Swedish time. So tell me a bit, more, a bit more about yourself, Swedish House. I mean, do you have any children? Are you married or anything like that? What other hobbies do you do? Obviously, gaming is one of them. It'd be nice to sort of know a bit more about the, about my awesome viewers. Sometimes very frustrated that need to finish all phases to save game. Yes, that can be a bit of an issue. So obviously, well, you need to get off to a good start, don't you? Um, 
you start losing too many people and then you save it, you're going to make it, make it difficult for yourself. So don't waste those grenades. And obviously later in the later levels, don't waste your bazookas. Because when those bazooka people turn up, they are tough. The accuracy level of them is very, very high. But yes, I might do that today actually. I might save it today. That's a big swim. No, 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 no. And obviously you can't, well, in the shallow water you can, but obviously your shooting is affected in the water. This is a cool game, the soundtrack is great. Yes, brilliant, isn't it? Have you completed it before? I don't know anyone that has. Obviously, I don't use cheats. I haven't played the second one. Be nice to sort of finish the first one first before attempting the second. But anyway, any more games you want to request, please do so. I've actually got through quite a lot of games today. I'm actually getting through them quick, pretty, pretty quickly. No. <laughs> Hello, Peter. How are you doing, my friend? Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, me and Pete. Me and Pete used to work together, and uh, he's a big retro fan. So it was never, it was inevitable. We were going to be good, good mates. But he's, he's going to be move, moving house soon, but yeah, he's got a big gaming room and unfortunately he's had to pack all his games away. But in his new house, he'll have a bigger house and a... Well, I assume it's a bigger house, but he'll have a bigger games room. Thanks for tuning in, mate. I'm guessing you've been to football? Yeah, you can't beat it, can you? Yes, modern day games are fantastic. They look the bee's knees. But retro is still the way to go. I know the endings are pretty poo. The reward isn't great. But it's a great feeling when you finish an old game. We've got someone dying up there. He's going to have to die slowly and painfully, I'm afraid. I'm not going to swim over just to put him out of his misery. Ah, you're outside now. Yeah, you might have seen this game on Right Retro Gaming stream, but obviously it's slightly different this time. It's just me, and there's not a lot, there's no banter. It's just me constantly playing this, but I'm trying to fit in as many games as I can. It's actually, I think this is the fourth game I've played so far, isn't it? I play Ghouls, Gobs, um, Girls and Goblins. Huh. Who? Hugh? Huh? Ugh. That's it. Ugh. Phineas Farge. Yes, it's the fourth game. Don't usually play this many games. So, did you win tonight? Did you score any goals? Yes, yeah, so I was talking about you earlier. Sorry I had to sort of knock the, the um, uh, Mega Drive stream on the head tonight. I mean, I, I wanted to, but obviously I'd already announced it to everybody. Um, yeah, I, I think we need to, well certainly Adrian, we need to get quite an amount of notice. That way I don't sort of make any plans. But I do definitely want to do one, a, a Mega Drive stream. I think that'd be a, that'd be a, a good success. The game doesn't need to rely on graphics alone. No. Right, time for another question. Question, this is the last question. Make sure I don't get shot. That's not the question. Right. Question two. Well, I've actually done question three seconds. So question, this is the next question. 
What are your favourite game soundtracks? Yeah, Peter, you have no... It's really t difficult to try and come up with different questions. I'm trying to keep them all gaming related, but trouble is I'm doing ones every single week. And I'm running out of different questions. But um, I'm going to be doing a quiz when I get to 200 subscribers. Which I think will be a, a good success. Ah! That was very nearly a death by a roof. But I'm going to try and really, I'm going to really put a lot of effort into it. I'm going to try and come up with all different subjects, different uh, rounds. Try and spice it up because I want to try and make it last the whole, you know, a good, a good, a good stream amount of time. Obviously, I can't give away too much because obviously I don't want people to know know what I'm going to put on before it actually happens. That free CD with a retro gamer was a great example of decent soundtracks. It's brilliant, isn't it? We should do that more often. But I love that Phantom of the Asteroids because I've got that game on C64. But it's nice when they sort of add extra things, you know, like, like the calendar and the uh, discs. Shadow of the Beast 1, 2, 3, yes, yeah, so they're all good. Turrican, you can't go wrong with Turrican. Suits of Rage. Whoa! I can't remember how that goes. I don't know how, I know how the first, second one goes. I'm not familiar with the first one. I'm going to do a Suits of Rage video, hopefully. Try and do some of the old school sort of. Classic beat em ups. Want to do Final Fight as well. Alien 3. I've got Alien 3 on the Amiga. I've not played the Genesis version. Is the Genesis version as difficult as the Amiga version? Because I can't, I can't get anywhere on that. What makes that game so difficult is the time limit. You've got to save the people in the time limit. And obviously, if you don't save them in the time limit, then the aliens burst out of their chests. But yes, there's so many. There's so many great soundtracks. Um, obviously, Turrican, um, R-Type, Z-Out, um, Project X. I mean, not all of them have a lot of uh, music, but the, 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 the uh, title of Project X. But even on, even on PlayStation 1, I love the Croc soundtrack. The R-Type Delta soundtrack. This is loads. Right. Now this one has quicksand, doesn't it? Speedball, of course. Yes, that's got a great, a great song. I need to finish that. My, um, I need to do another video for that. I need to do my Division One or Division Two, whichever way. Oh, Division One. I need to do my video for that. So I got promoted. But I need to do the next the next division, which is going to be a lot more difficult. Yeah, Shadow of the Beast is brilliant. There's so many different versions on YouTube. I think this is actually the best guy I've ever had of this game because I haven't touched wood. I haven't lost I haven't lost anyone yet. I'm guessing five is the most you can get in terms of squad. I don't know if that is right. So if anyone knows the answer to that, please let me know. This is where I speak too soon and one dies. Whoa, someone's thrown a grenade. What was that me? Luckily, there was a delay on that grenade, so that was enough to let me get away. I'm stuck. I'm going back to soundtracks. I really want to do a video of Guitar Hero. But the trouble with that is obviously 
the rights to use the songs. So it's going to be a bit. I don't know how I'm going to get around that. But I love Guitar Hero, and I, I'm actually I'm, I, I can do the pro level. I'm not quite an expert yet, but I would love to do a video for that. But I don't know how you get around that problem. Because what I was going to do, I know it's a bit geeky and a bit stupid, but I'm going to do my favourite songs on either pro, either hard or expert. I'm going to do a four-way split. So one of the boxes is going to have me doing the vocal, one do, doing the, the guitar and the and the um, the bass, and then one of them the drums, and then obviously the song playing in the background. That's what I really want to do. It's going to be quite embarrassing. It's going to be quite fun, but that's what I want to do. But I need to try and figure out how you use normal music. I guess you've got to pay for it. But I think it'd be worth it. I think that'd be good fun. If anyone knows the answer to that, how you use normal music on YouTube, obviously there are free samples. But they're not all they're not all free. Five or six, can't remember, but I think it was six in later levels. What 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 sorry, what what, what are we talking about here? Escape from Collids. What's that? I haven't played that. Was also good. Mission 5, phase 1 of 3. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to post this as much as I can. Is that it? No, that's not it. Six soldiers in the mission. Oh, I see. Sorry, mate. I'm with you. I'm with you now. Soldiers in the mission. Oh, I see. Sorry, guys. Hold on. Right, with three soldiers, you must kill all enemy. Destroy enemy buildings. Okay. Yes. Oh, we got three. I think I've already got three. Hmm. Yes. Um, I hope that's all right with you. It would just be nice to have a, a bit of change of scenery. I do like Ashford Town Centre, but I think Maidstone is better. Plus, it's got HMV. Is it actually? I think there's two games in Maidstone, isn't there? Was there one? I can't remember. And also, Peter, I'm hoping that Maidstone will have. Oh! Did anyone see what happened there? Because I didn't see what happened. Did I get killed by a, a, a roof? Um, I want. I'm quite tempted to buy a play, uh, C64 Mini. I'm hoping Maidstone will have it. So I don't think Ash should have got it. I don't actually know what happened there. If anyone can tell me, because I don't actually know what happened. I looked away and I looked back and everyone was dead. Which is a shame, because that was, that was actually going really, really well. In terms of games, Peter, I, there's not really any I want to buy at the moment. I'm pretty much up to date. I bought uh, Dirt, the new Dirt game, which I still haven't played. Where is all my... Uh? They got, they got stuck behind a tree. Yeah, I'm not too, I'm not too bothered about the boot fair. But if you want to go, we'll go. But I don't, I don't do boot fairs. The trouble is, I like, I, I don't, I like to buy stuff in good nick. But I suppose, in a way, you know, because obviously now I've got my own place, so I probably would buy things I probably wouldn't normally have bought. So, I don't know. It's up to you. Shoot! 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 But yeah, I don't actually know what killed me. I'm, it's a mystery. Obviously, I've got bazookas now, and I've got grenades. 
Now, I don't know when those bazookas start coming into play. I think there might be one down the bottom there. Trouble is, you've got to kill these guys, but try not to blow up the grenades. Trouble is, it's hard to do when there's so many people around. best I could do I think. Need bazooka to kill the bazooka guy. Well, you can do it without. If you keep on the move, just keep moving and, and shooting, that's a way around it as well. You can do it like that. If you're standing still, they're going to kill you instantly. But keep moving. But yeah, they are so accurate. It's ridiculous. Or you can throw a grenade over the tree. Have some of that. Didn't see that coming, did he? Yeah, like that. Just keep moving, keep moving. Keep moving. Lost one. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. And also you can't save it until you've done all three. Where's Lee gone? Lee, where have you gone, mate? It's going well, it's going well. I don't know how much longer I'll play it, I'll play it for, but I'm up for a different game if anyone wants to put a suggestion in. Lee did mention Rip Dangerous 2, but I don't know if Lee is still here. Dangerous, that's, that's another really difficult game. Loads of bazookas, loads of them! Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. I know I've got, well, I suppose I could use a few of them, can I? Let's use some of them. Are there any retro game shops in Maidstone? Um. Can't think any off the top of my head. But I think the game is, is bigger, and obviously the CX is there. Um. There's gotta be somewhere, surely. There's gotta be. Whoops. Slip sliding away. I say none are springing to mind, Peter. Oh, the screen keeps moving off with me. Right. That one actually does kill himself. Yeah, have some of that. I'll have a look into it, my friend. I'll, 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 I'll Google it. I say there's a, there's a HMV as well, and also, I, I do miss the HMV in, uh, in, in Ashford. I don't know why they got rid of it in Ashford. I don't like buying DVDs online because they might arrive damaged in the post. And again, it's just a part of me that's fussy. That's the fussy bit of me. It's nothing more annoying when something arrives and it's damaged, or scratched, or whatever. Dented, ripped, torn. It's not a good thing. <sighs> ah, cheers my friends. Yeah, I'm a bit busy at the minute, I can't quite do it. I'm trying to kill people. Oh, that's bad. That's bad, Jamie. A 
nice set of bazookas. Oh, TV's gonna turn itself off every single time. It does that to me. Oh, Pete! You're on the screen! Pete! Pete, Tadger and Hector. I'll try and not kill it, get you killed, mate. I think you're actually the leader. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll leave you behind, because I don't want you to die. How about that? Because you can actually separate them. Oh, that's Pete. There's Pete there. So let's... Uh... Let's try and protect Pete. Pete's the main man. Obviously Pete, I've left him behind, but he will defend himself. He will stay exactly where I put him, but he will defend himself if he has to. Alright. How are you getting on? He should blow himself up. Oh, he's learnt his lesson. Or you could just do that. Uh, building is destroyed as soon as it as soon as its door fly. You need to destroy the whole house. Yes. The whole house. Okay. Right, we've got a big, 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 big swim. So there's a building down the bottom here, which you've got to blow up, otherwise I'll just keep me spawning out of that hole. Ah, uh, Pete! I've got to use Pete now. Pete, Pete, you're on, you're on, you're, you're on the screen again. It's all down to you, Pete. Unfortunately, I've now don't have any bazookas. That guy had it. down to Pete. Possible to save Pete by pressing escape. <laughs> but then Pete could save the day. He could. Survive! 
save on them, Pete! You done well, Pete! <laughs> I have saved you from the evils of the bazooka people. Sixty-two recruitments remains. Recruits. Okay. Oh, one mouse. That one. That, that worked well. That was a bullseye. That's that uh, vehicle, isn't it? Oh, that thing, yes, of course. Yeah, you have to jump over that ramp. But this one, you only have to blow up the enemy buildings. Right, we're in. We're in. Okay, let's try and get this right, shall we? Well, that didn't work, did it? <laughs> Softy, Mac, and Pete. Well, that didn't go well, did it? Perhaps I didn't have enough run-up. I'm back! You're, you're on the screen, mate! You're on the screen! You are safe at the moment. You're at the top right here with, with Softy. Sorry, but what I say... You missed it, mate! <laughs> The level before, you saved the day. You killed everybody. I made sure you were safe. Is he going to blow himself up? <coughs> what is that? It's a little glitch. Right, we need a big swim. Nearest shots are Croydon or Brighton, and obviously London. It's a bit too far. My word. This is a big swim. Where am I located? Oh, where I am, where I live, Ashford in Kent. In the UK, obviously. I think that question was actually asked on the previous stream, but I missed it. But yes. Pete, it's down to you again. A one-man army. If I can if I can finish this level, I can save it. Trouble is, a very long swim. But obviously, we don't have to kill all the enemy; only the buildings. Trouble is, if you don't blow the buildings up, they'll keep coming out of the buildings. He, well, yeah, but at least he's alive. <laughs> he's alive and well. He 
You could be the next Arnold Schwarzenegger going solo. Pete's a good swimmer. Sorry, Pete. <laughs> you used to have a good retro s scene. Um. Whoa, chips. Do you, do you mean chips? Um, I have one more go. And I'm going to put the next game on. Sweetie's house, you want to make a suggestion? That was a silly mistake. That was a very silly mistake. Whoops, he got stuck. Yes, um... I bought a few games from there, which I still do have them. I don't know what it's called now. It's not called chips anymore though, is it? Oh no, the bubble has popped, hasn't it? And obviously where Chips was, it's behind McDonald's, you get yourself some chips as well. After you've been on chips or fries. Come on Jamie, let's finish this. Let's get it saved. Obviously we're only blowing up the enemy buildings. We don't need to blow up, kill all the enemy. Word. Norm, Buster, Spike and Brownie. The Consulting Gamer. Ah, okay. It's more like a... Yeah, I'm not into all that. Well, I don't understand it. That's the problem. If I understood it, then maybe, but... It's just not my thing. Right, I'm going to try this again, but I'm going to take a big, big, well, not a run-up, is it? Oh. Killer is a good name. He was. He's dead now. He's been ki Killer's been killed. Right, last go. I can do this. I can do this. Let's leave one. Let's, 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 leave, let's go with Goofy, shall we? <coughs> Gaw, Glomix. Gosh. Right. Oh my god, get out. Oh my word, what am I doing? Donald Duck. Who likes Donald Duck? I like Donald Duck. Right. One of them's called Windy. Oh my god, I can't. Oh, hang on. He survived. Good. Time to swim, yeah. Quick. 
Quickly! 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 Oh, God, I killed him. Let's go for Windy. When times are tough, send in Windy. Be afraid of Windy. Go, go, go! Quickly! Right. I've only got one bazooka, well, one bazooka left. Oh my gosh! What am I doing? Well, I'm off, sir. I shall see you Sunday morning. You shall indeed. Take it easy. I can't believe I did that. What an absolute plonker. I can't believe I did that. I'm not proud of that. That was definitely a loser uh, moment, that is. No. <laughs> Swedish House! I don't know how many more people are watching. Do you want to make any more suggestions? Let's have a Actually, I can do it for my let's do it for myself for once, shall we? Stop relying on people. How many people now? You'll probably beat that. Beat. It. You'll probably. Pardon me. Six people watching. Good stuff. Do you want to make a suggestion? While you're while you're while you're making up your mind, I'll have one more go. But yes, please do make a suggestion. I don't know where Lee's gone. I think he's probably. Fall asleep. I'm gonna go with Denzel. I've got to get this car thing sorted. I've got to get it fixed. Uh, got to figure it out. Oh my word, Cedric. Go for Cedric. I've got a funny. I think one of my. I think my nieces might be watching, but they don't comment. <laughs> They say that they watch, but they don't comment. If you are watching, please do say hello, honestly. It's... We're nice people around here. Just say hi. Okay, I'm going to get this right. I'm going to sort this out. Let's get a nice, decent... Long drive up, get the speed up, and then we'll go for it. I was trying to run him over, but that didn't work. I see what you mean, Swedish house. It's a bit of a pain, isn't it? How would you do it then? How do you do it? That was a pretty decent drive up as well, but um didn't work. Mm -hmm. Bad news written over it, it says. Go! Go! No, he's got stuck! He got stuck! 
Possibly the fire with right button in Sudoku or just cars. I think both. So you need to add press another button to get the speed up, yeah? Sounds about right. Sounds right. Probably is right. We'll try, shall we? Whoops. I'm sure it is a beautiful skidsu when it works. But I've got to figure out how it works. Right, this is really the last one, guys, and I'm going to play something else. Right, left button speed, right button fire. Oh, it fires, does it? Ah. Oh. I got him. We'll go for Wally, shall we? I didn't know they fired. That's handy to know. My word. Pervy! When times are tough, let's send in Pervy, shall we? Come on, Pervy. Trouble is with these sort of games, I get pins and needles in my hand. It's leaning on that table for so long. See, that's right mouse button there. I'm pressing both buttons now. No, you see? Hmm. I don't know, mate. Oh! Jasper! What are you doing? Knock my mouse off the table. You killed the mouse. There we go. I'm going to leave it there, guys. Right, what next? What's the bleh? Next game, people! What do you want to go for? Have a, have a, have a, have a, des have a decide. That will have to be done another day. Trouble is, I don't want to be stuck on the same level for so long. Because I want to try and fit as much in as I can. Ah, you are here, Lee Robertson. Ah, okay, let me see if I've got Rick Dangerous 2. I've definitely got Rick Dangerous 1. Let me see. Yes, it's an hour forward, but Swedish House, he is an awesome guy. I mean, he watched the whole thing. Golden Axe. The only problem I've got with that is the GoTech version is slightly glitched. Now what I could do, I could plug in my other Amiga and then use the disc. Because a lot of you know, not all of them are perfect. Yes, you can probably get it, but trying to find a perfect copy is not simple. Hold on, let's have a look. If I've got Rick Dangerous 2, then we'll go for it. If I don't have Rick Dangerous 2, there is it dangerous too. Um, you love. I mean, I, what was, well, but dangerous is tough, very very tough. It probably it probably won't be a very very long playthrough, but I could I could switch I could play Golden Axe afterwards. I mean, I mean, has anyone got past? Has anyone actually finished this game? I, again, I don't know anyone that has. I think I do prefer one, only because I've played one more times. Uh, right, so it's eight. Unfortunately, I don't have a box. Now that, again, is, is, is quite a surprise. 
because I've owned it for so long, but I don't have a boxed version. I didn't realise you were still here, Lee, mate. But then it is quite late, mate, isn't it? Right, Rick Dangerous. Two. Rick Dangerous two. So what shift are you... What shift are you on next week? Peter, um, Lee? Are you on nights next week as well? I vote Jamie has the number one retro stream on the YouTube. <laughs> Two thumbs up. I hope so. I try my best. I really do. I just love what I do. I, I, I enjoy it. I don't swear. I don't get angry. I just keep it clean. Just, just keep going. I don't... Plus one. I, don't, I, just, I just don't see the point in getting angry and frustrated. Yes, you, I mean, I know people have banter. There's no banter here because there's no one here to have banter with. But I just enjoy doing what I do. That's what it's all about. Just do what you enjoy. Plus one. What do you mean plus one? Two watching. <laughs> it's late in the day. Right, I haven't played this one for a while. It's been a while since I've done this. Uh, you the best, Jamie. And you're the best viewers. You really are. Honestly, if, if I don't have decent viewers, I don't want to do it. But the decent viewers makes you want to do, wants me to be able to crack on with this. So I didn't read that first bit. Um, back in a flash, as Rick Dangerous as ever. Right, now this one you just have to run for it, don't you? Now this is a bit of a blur. Obviously there are lots of traps and hazards. I'm not expecting to get very far, but I'll try my best. But there's always hazards, things that are going to shoot at you and you don't expect it. That's what makes it so difficult. The first one, that first level, there's always spikes that Boing, boing out of the walls, right underneath you, or right as, you, as you're climbing down, things get sh you get shot at. Oh, blimey. Actually, made me jump. All this destruction, and he's still got a big grin on his face. Look at him. He's smiling. Mind you, he was smiling in the first one as well. Obviously, bullets are limited. That thing there, doesn't that look like the T-Virus in Resident Evil? This thing, it's quite similar, doesn't it? I know this game too well, I know when it's going to fire at you. So how many people have played this and how far have you got? See what I mean? How mean is that? It tells you to do it and it's a trap. It's a trap. 
This is the first level, and already it's giving you really tricky traps. It's lying to you on the first level. Hey, I'm glad you're still here. See that? Is that one going to shoot me as well? What do you reckon? I don't know. Yeah, so next Friday, um... Lee, are you late shift again? Or night shift? Tried Red Dangerous 2, but only a few minutes. Wah! Yes! <laughs> uh, only played Red Dangerous 1 and it's brilliant. I actually made a... Um... Hold on. I made a hammer bead of that one. I don't like taking them off the wall because they're very, very fragile. But yeah, I did make, made, Rick Dangerous one. Obviously, it's quite small. Is it? It was quite. It was smaller than I thought it'd be. But um, yeah, they don't like to be moved. Once you put them on the wall and then you keep unsticking them and sticking them back on, they do snap. But I suppose I need to make. Pardon me. I need to make a Rick Dangerous two one. Me, do I? Shouldn't be too bad. All right. Right, they're points, I assume. How are you, Gumdio? What are you doing this weekend? Yeah, right, like last time you told me to do it, it killed me. You lied to me. I'll be uploading my Beachhead 2 video tomorrow and hopefully you'll like it. I've tried a few different things. It's quite a long game but obviously it does have a lot of loading times but I've, I've, I've cut all those bits out but I'm, I'm quite happy with it. I'm also this weekend I'm going to try, I'll, I'll do a little bit more of uh, Ghosts uh, Ghost and Goblins. And I'm gonna have another. I'm gonna have an attempt at uh, Project X. So I really want to finish that. Right. What do you reckon? Up or left? Oh, that's not. That's not. That's not a ladder. It looks like a ladder. I'm out of bullets! Oh my gosh, I'm out of bullets! That is not a good time to run out of bullets. Ah, oh, that actually made me jump again! Oh my word! Do you know what? I'm one of these people, it takes a lot to make me jump. I can watch all these. I can watch these spooky films. They don't make me jump. But this game has made me jump twice. Rick Dangerous Two makes me jump more than horror films. I suppose if you're watching a horror film, you sort of expect it, don't you? But this game, you don't really expect it. Hello Jasper, come on, don't be camera shy. Oh no! <laughs> oh dear. Well unfortunately guys, I think I'm going to have to wrap it up soon, but I really don't want to because I'm really enjoying it, but it is getting late. Oh, 
I really do look forward to these every Friday. It's... As soon as one finishes, I really want to crack on with another one, but... Uh, really good. It's nice to be back on Amiga again, even though it was only for a week. Right. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a different I'm gonna do this differently. I'm not making that mistake again. Well. The trouble is, which one is it gonna be? Okay. Oh. Amiga. Amiga. Obviously I'm gonna do that Mega Drive stream, but I don't think Adrian and Pete, well, Pete might be, but I don't think Adrian's going to be available because he's working. So, until I get that okay for, the, for that, for that, that um, stream, then I'll do it. But until that happens, I'll stick with Rick Dangerous. That, <laughs> stick with Emiga, sorry. But I might do a Commodore 64. I'm really tempted to buy an, uh, a C64 Mini. As much as I love my Commodore 64, whoops. As much as I love my Commodore 64, I mean that is still absolutely immaculate. I've got two of them, and my other one's over there. But the games, there's a few games, they're just they're, they're not working properly. It's now showing signs, and it's not working properly. I don't know if it's. I don't know if it needs a good clean, but my floppy drive as well. I've got all these discs, and I can't play them because my disc drive doesn't work, and it's a really, really old disc drive. Amiga. Yeah. To be honest, only one. Of, I went to game in Folkestone about a month or so ago and I saw one in there it was actually it was in a display cabinet and I looked at it and I thought I really want to but I, I don't know if I could the, I, the money I didn't have the money at the time and I walked away from it and I kept looking back and I thought no I can't I gotta be good I've got to pay the bills but we're going, me and Pete are going out to Maidstone in Kent on Sunday and I might get it then might get it then. It's about sixty quid, but but the possibilities are endless. I'm still going to buy games for for my original because this is the way I am. But there's so many games I want to play. Batman the movie and Untouchables. I've only played Batman the movie on the Amiga. Never played any other versions. I mean, what do you reckon? Do you think a C64 stream would be a success? Again, it's one of those things. I mean, I was surprised the PS1 one didn't do very well. Obviously, I've got the, I've got the usual awesome viewers. But it's not really attracting new members. But um, surely C64 will be a success, surely. Yeah, hope, hopefully you don't mind. I'm going to have another go. <laughs> But Untouchables, I've not played that. Again, I think I've played the Amiga version, but that was years and years ago. I can't remember a lot about it. Is it like a first person game? I can't remember. Is it one with a crosshair? <laughs> right.
But I love Batman the movie, it's brilliant. I love the original Batman films as well. Yes, I think it would be a success. People who love Amiga usually start with C64. Yeah, that's what we did. I can't remember what age I was. I mean, I, mu I must have been. I was born in 82, so I reckon I was probably about three, maybe four when we got, when we got, we got ours. Um... And we looked after it, you know, we really did. Okay, it had the occasional time where it needed to be fixed. But, um... Yeah, it, it's, it does work pretty well. It's just the occasional game that, that, that does tend to stop working, but... You know, these games are old, you know? I mean, it is... Sh Some of it is slowing, it's showing a little bit of signs of wear. My, my tape deck it needs a bit of work. The, um... You know, the lead, I don't know if you can see, but that lead is a bit damaged there. It just needs a bit of, I don't know, I, 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 can't, I don't know if I've got it in me to fix it really. I don't know if I've got the right tools, but it just needs a little bit of TLC. In terms of condition, it looks immaculate. It's not a mark on it. We had Nez. I used to have a NES, but I had to sell it. And also, I've been tempted to do a, a SNES stream. You know, I want to do Killer Instinct and Donkey Kong and stuff like that. And Starwing. Is it Starwing? Star Fox. I really want to do stuff like that. But again, I just don't know whether it's going to be popular or not. It's really difficult to, to, to do. Whoopsie. Hello, cat. Oh, do you want to go and sit there, do you? Go on in. Sit there. Um. It is. <laughs> Why have you joined so late in the day? I want most people in bed. Unsociable cat. I do a SNES stream, sorry, if do a SNES stream, then I request Super Mario, yes, that's a good point actually. What I might do actually, I thought about it before, I've been tempted to do, I've run out of bullets again, I've been tempted to do um, a Mario stream, but make it a bit silly, I was going to dress up like Mario, I've got a Luigi outfit, but I might buy a Mario outfit and dress up like Mario, I think that might, might be quite cool. There's actually another video I'm, I'm, I want to do, but as crazy as it sounds, I'm waiting for a shirt to arrive. There's a certain shirt that I'm going to wear for it. I don't want to. I don't want to say it now because I've got, I've got to save it for the video. But it's 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 coming from. A, I don't know where it's coming from, but it's taking a long time to arrive. So obviously I can't do the video until it arrives. But I'm going to try and make them a bit better. You know. God, really? But when you see it, it'll, it'll, it'll make sense. So it's, it's, you know, it's like the requests for people. You know, if people put requests on, I want to do them. That's how that. I was born in 76. Atari's 2600, Vic, Xbox 360, and soon to be Xbox One. And we will do some streams. Or videos. Well, definitely videos, if you're out for that. I don't think streams is going to work. Because obviously, the, the, the issue I'm having with the laptop. We could definitely do a, a normal video, like I did with my players un player unknowns battlegrounds. So 
So when you get it, mate, what games are you going to get? Do you know? Do you know yet? Wee, that was close. This is going to be interesting. Ah! Oh! God, blimey, how close was that? I deserve that. Well, it wasn't a stream. It was a, it was just a, a video. But that you have no idea how difficult that was to edit. It was about a four-hour uh, video. But trouble is, I don't swear, but my friends do. So I was trying to cut out all the swearing, and obviously put all the best bits out, take out all the uh, the gobbledy gook. But I managed to get it down to about one hour eight, and I'm really chuffed with it. I was really really chuffed. It's really <laughs> some bits of it do still make me laugh. But yeah, it was good. Uh, my son wants that Sonic game you play. That is brilliant. That is really good. Because it's gone back to how it should be. Not all this stupid 3D malarkey. It doesn't work. 3D doesn't work. It's, well, some people like it. See, uh, some games work well in 3D. Some games don't. Obviously, if you're playing something like Crash Bandicoot, then yes, because it was already in 3D. But when something is 2D and then you introduce it into 3D, it doesn't work. It's just, nah. It's like, I don't know, I'm trying to think of an example. I don't know. Think of like flashback, another world, um, kid chaos, rough and tumble. Make that three D. I think that's going to ruin it. And obviously, on the, uh, while we're on the subject of this, I finally played the new Red Ro Red Rogers the other day because I bought that, which is basically rough and tumble. I played it the other day. I didn't like it. Whoa! I really didn't like it. It didn't do it for me. I was a bit disappointed. Even though it's 2D, I didn't like it. It just wasn't the same. Right, let's learn from that. Nah. I've not really played many Zelda games, to be honest with you. I mean, going back to the, the Sonic, the worst Sonic game I have played was that werewolf one. How bad? I, I, pfft, how bad was that? That was my own. That's my opinion, of, of course. But that, that was appalling. I can't believe they did that. Right. This is going to be interesting. I'm gonna die, I like Rip Dangerous is certainly living dangerously. Ah This is such a difficult game, there's no question of that. I mean imagine Imagine Crash Bandicoot 2D. That probably wouldn't work. I mean, imagine Crash Bandicoot like this. That's different because it was originally 3D. I don't think that will work as 2D. I can't imagine a 2D Crash Bandicoot running around. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Is it that time of day now? You've, you've, you've now had enough. You've run around too much. You're now going to sit here and just sleep all night. Right. Oh my word, okay.
Ah! So you can't, you can't, you can't. Ah! <laughs> oh, he should have cleaned himself. He'd be there about an hour doing that. I know all cats do it, dogs do it, but he takes ages to clean himself. Right, last life. I'm gonna call it a day. Honestly, guys, it's been brilliant. Thanks very, thank you very much for tuning in. It's great to have Lee back. Are you gonna be around next Friday, or are you back on nights again? He's. I suppose it's quite simple if you think about it. Let's do that. Right, is he going to jump down? No. A clean cat. Yeah. Hey. Ah! Oh, maybe jump as well. Wasn't expecting that. Can you blow him up? Ah. Ah. What a way to end it! Killed by a guy in a barrel. I got killed by a guy in a barrel. <laughs> seen, uh, never seen a dirty cat. Well, he has dirty paws from time to time. Great shame. Keep up the great work. I try my best. To be honest, I have, uh, that's another thing, I've been ch because this um, Streamlabs hasn't been working, I was, I actually did set up a, um, like a, what's, what's it, it's, what is it called, a pay, it's not PayPal, is it, it's like a donation bar or something, I tried that, but of course it's not working, it's not working, because my laptop goes all, bloop, 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 it goes weird. But anyway, oh actually I didn't realise, that's core as well. Hmm. What is it with core games? They don't have... Actually, um, Lee, I've come up with an idea. You know core games, they don't have sound effects and music. I've come up with an idea. What I'm going to do... Um, hopefully it will work. For example, Jaguar, right? I'm assuming Jaguar XJ, whatever it is, has got sound effects. Now what I'm going to do, and I'm going to try it with Chuck Rock as well, and Premiere. I'm going to play it with the sound effects, no music. And then I'm going to play it through with just the music. And then I'm going to hopefully blend them both together. So you've got the sound effects and the, and the music. I think that would be good. I'm sure people have tried it, but I think that'd be a nice touch because you can't play it with both. So if you can't play it with both, make it possible. Make it possible because Premiere again is a great example. It's got great music, but you want the sound effects as well. So we just blend it together. Now, Chuck Rock has got a great song, but unfortunately, it's only got one great song. That's, that's all it is. So what I might do, I might do it with that. But just have like the first level have the music, then the music stops. Finish the rest of the level with the sound effects. Level two starts. Kick in the music. Play it through once. Sound effects. What do you reckon? It's probably gonna take a while. But I just think that'd be a nice touch. If you're watching it in a way you wouldn't expect and you're not familiar with. There is the occasional one though, Chuck Rock 2, that does have both. But yeah, I mean this one, you could, yeah, you could do the same with this. The possibilities are endless, you know what I mean? But I've got so many core games, you know, just yeah, loads. Alright guys! Uh, to be honest with you, it is what? 
just gone half past twelve, or half past one Swedish time, I'm not going to bed yet. I am not going to bed yet. I'm going to upload this. I'm going to do what I did the last two weeks. That way it is a, su a successful upload, because if I don't do what I've been doing, it doesn't upload the whole thing. I'll post this in the Amiga page tomorrow and see what happens, but subscribers are very difficult to get. Very difficult, but I'm trying. I really am trying, but... Uh, what? Actually, one last thing before I go. Um, obviously, we've, we've spoken about this before, about negative comments. The other day, I had a comment on my R-Type video. Now, I didn't cheat in that. It was a playthrough from start to finish, and obviously, I only died once. But the other day, I had a comment on that, and one person put, Jamie, you cheated at this. You use cheats. Now, I looked at this guy's profile. He doesn't have any footage. He doesn't have any videos or anything. But he put, you cheated. And I commented and said, I don't use cheats. Why, you know, what makes him so such an expert? Just by watching, so... I didn't use cheats. Why did he put, you use cheats? What, what, why does he think I use cheats? Just because I completed it, doesn't necessarily mean I used cheats. I didn't cheat. I deleted it anyway, I, I blocked it, but uh... The cheek of the man! Hey! The cheek of the... Do you want a treat? The treats? You watch his... watch his ears. Look at him go! Treats! Treats! Oh yes! He will never turn down treats, there you go. <laughs> Last bit of fun and I'm going to end it. Oh hello, you're going to move now are you? Huh. Treat for Jasper! Can't do this one handed. <laughs> oh yes, he likes that. Come on then. He loves his treats. He loves his treats. Oh, my camera's all, all, all swanny now. Look at it. Oh, dear. No more. Apparently, apparently, when you give a cat one of these treats, that's like one donut for a human. So there's quite a lot in there. He was trolling you. Yeah. It's, it's weird. I don't understand it. No more, cat. You've had enough. That's mine. You're not having that. That's mine. Now what are you doing? Sorry guys, I'm rabbiting on. Alright, I'll do some more videos this weekend and I'll upload my Beachhead 2 video tomorrow and hopefully you'll enjoy that. And I'm going to crack on with some more videos. Alright guys, really appreciate it. You are the best ever. The best viewers by a long shot. But, uh, hopefully you have a nice weekend. I'm, I'm sure I'll probably hear from Lee over the weekend. And there might be a PlayStation, uh, sorry, a C64 Mini soon. <laughs> Take it easy, guys. I'll see you next week, uh, next Friday. We'll do it all again. Keep giving me requests, and I'll see what I can do. Uh, please like my Facebook page. If you want to put some comments on there, please do so. All right. Take it easy, guys. Ciao.